Oh. <laughs> so, this is my house. <laughs> Thank you, Ma. Um, it's okay. Ma, where is Victor's room? Okay, Victor's room is upstairs. The room on the right and the one opposite is your room. Oh, okay. And then if you need anything, don't hesitate to tell me. Alright? No problem, Ma. Feel comfortable. Be free. Oh, Victor, show her to the room. Victor, let's go. Listen to me. I'm here to work. And if your little witch makes it any difficult for me, hmm, then be ready to die. What did I say? Be ready to die. Are you mad? You would rather be dead. Remove your uniform. Clean your room and wait for further instructions from me. I call you and you ignore me. I will kill you that day. Are we mates? Eh? Come and go to your room and get your uniform. You come and wash it here. When you are done, you come and meet me at the kitchen. 
we are going to prepare dinner. Go. Wash it very well. Useless thing. You think because I came here as a maid, I will do everything. I will cook for you. I will cook for that your foolish mother. By the way, where did she even go, Sef? I'm sure she has gone to cheat on your father. Nonsense. Better hurry up, oh. You have to go and start cooking. Wash it very well. Wash it. Nonsense. Wash it, oh. Wash it well. Wash it. son doing here? Uh, assignment, homework. Yes, he said they asked them to monitor the process of house chores and take notes. So, I mean, no, you can't make a note by mere assumptions. And you have to watch and even partake. Okay, that's good. But why is he rubbing his eyes? Oh, the soap. Uh, the soap entered his eyes. You should be more careful, okay? Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, assignment, right? Alright. Victor, continue washing, okay? <laughs> Alright, I'll, I'll be in my room. Why were you crying? So that now your useless mother will do what? Notice you. Mm, get out. Wash! Wash it very well. Wash it. Ah, my dear, that's my new maid. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Wow. It's not easy. Hmm. You know, <laughs> taking care of Victor is not an easy task. I swear. Hi. Hey. I was even pitying you because handling that boy, Victor. Hey. It's a big one. It's not easy. Big one. Waking up at 5 a.m. Oh, mom. I don't have for like one day. I tell you. Let me go and get my phone upstairs before okay. my husband calls me. <laughs> okay. Chai. Oh. Hi, dear. Hi, Frida. Did you just call me by my name? Uh, oh, um, I'm very sorry. It was a mistake. Um, take back this drink and um, get me a glass of water instead. It should be well. Thank you. See, take the one you see. Ah, ah, ah. Come back here. Is this girl okay? Ah, hey, egg by meal. Come back here. Come here. Like that. Leave me alone. The next time you try this nonsense again, I will not only slap you, but I'll break your head. Useless girl. Huh? How dare you slap me? How dare you slap me? The next time you try it, I'll kill you.
No. I think she got a distress call. Because it's like something is bothering her. Don't you think I should go and ask her what's happened? I humbly suggest you just let her be. She's acting like she's disturbed or something like that. Huh? <laughs> Advise her, Henry. <laughs> okay. I will do as you have said. <laughs> so what are you doing? Um, um... Okay, let's go ahead. <laughs> I heard Victor screaming, cats, cats. But I've not seen any cats here, oh. I didn't see any cats either. Victor, seems you watch too much of this, your cartoons. There's no cat here. Hey, darling. What's up? Oh, my dear, I'm so sorry, Jerry. Yes, I'm coming from Victor's room. Can you imagine? He said he saw a cat. <laughs> my dear, we don't rear cats here. <laughs> I swear down. Huh. Really? Yes, even Helen and I didn't see any cat though. Then you never can tell. Maybe Ellen girl is the cat. That girl is evil. Frida. Frida, can we not talk about my maid, please? Huh. Aina, I have told you. Get rid of that girl before she gets rid of you in that house. When are we traveling? <sighs> um, well, um, I've paid for the tickets, so you just have to balance me up. I will. Monday, right? Yeah, Monday. Um, so you can't pick me up? No, no. Please come and pick me. I should come pick you. Nah, I can never come pick you. As long as that Ellen girl is still in that house. Count me out. I'm not coming to pick you up. Frida, is it that serious? Yes, it is. It is very bad. I'm not coming. I beg. Okay. We'll meet at the airport. Yeah, bye. Mm. All right, darling. Thank you. This guy is so paranoid. Which one is?
will eat your excretes. Useless change. You know the festive period is coming, so I need to restock. Okay, ma. But mom, can I come with you? No, baby. You can't come with me. You know school is still in session and your exams are starting soon. Alright? So you have to stay back. And it's just for a few days, okay? <laughs> Helen, please, please take care of my son for me. Alright? Okay, ma. Don't worry, Victor. We'll be fine. Victor. Come on. Let me finish up here. Don't worry, the next trip I'll go with you. Alright? Come on, smile for me. Smile! <laughs> Yes, I'm telling Who is your auntie? Now listen to me. Your mother has gone out to prostitutes. Maybe she's going to have another bastard child like you. I'm in charge. This is my house. And I'm not going to stress myself. Beto, where are you going to? <laughs> oh God, this boy is such an imbecile. What an imbecile? Oh yes you are. And don't talk back at me, you nonsense child. My friend, before I close my eyes and open my eyes, you have removed that thing you call uniform. And go away from me in the kitchen. We are going to cook.
This boy likes enjoyment too. Just to clean and he's here sleeping. Okay. No problem. Screaming. Is the water that cold? We have a visitor. I don't want to hear pin or else. I will kill you. Do you hear me? Ben. Do I know you? Oh, I'm Helen. I work as a maid here, but don't worry about Rose. She got admission and had to quit. Wow, that's good. She never mentioned that to me. But my sister said she's out of town. What we do? Oh, come to think of it, how did you know my name? A witch like me knows everything. Um, sir, she, she, your sister told me you were coming. Oh. Oh, yes. Victor should be in school, obviously. Yes. Sir. I'm in the guest room. Oh, um, sir, um, do you want food? Oh, no. I'm good. Since you came, you haven't eaten any food. Are you hungry? No. Hmm. The food is nice, so. Helen, I am not hungry. I will eat tomorrow, okay? So please, you haven't eaten my food since. Not when Madame returns, you tell her I don't feed you well. Please, sir, sir, I don't want to lose my job. Helen, will you stop this? I said I am not hungry. Why don't you force me to eat? Ah. Wait, too. Where is Victor? Is he back from school? Has he eaten? Is he asleep? This room is dark. Victor, are you playing prank on me? You heard that? Ah! Victor! What happened to you? Who caught you? Go ahead, napkin. Any, okay, don't, don't let me go myself. Okay, let me. You are still alive. I thought you'd be dead by now. Foolish boy. Pick your 
call, pick your call, pick your call. I need to take this boy to the hospital. See, it's late already. Tomorrow morning. That's if he even survives it. Are you mad? Are you mad? How am I so sure you are not one that caught him? For slapping me, you will see. Look at you. I will beat you. Ah! That is just a warning. Good night. I will not only deal with you, you will also eat my pants. So guys, we will remain indoors until I figure out what to do with you two. Victor, if you like, scream from now till eternity. Nobody will hear you. As for your uncle, I've taken care of his sense of reasoning. All right, do we have a deal? Thank you, my darling. How are you? I'm fine, ma. 
So how is everybody? Everybody is fine, man. <laughs> how was your trip? Man? My trip was beautiful. <laughs> Welcome, Madam Fida. <laughs> how are you? I'm fine, ma. <laughs> okay, uh, bring my bag inside. Okay. <laughs> Home, sweet home. Yeah. Oh, it's good to be back. <laughs> come in, babe. Come in. <laughs> oh, so tired. Oh, God. Aina, I've told you, I'm, I'm not comfortable in coming to this, your place. This one you keep dragging me, I, I don't understand, though. Is it me? Uh -uh. Please, I'm very sorry if I said anything bad about you uh -uh. or did to you. Please forgive me. How? How can it be you? No. Uh -uh. Aina? Eh? It can't be. It can't be you. Uh -uh. It is not you. No. It's not you. It's not you. Uh -uh. Fida, huh? why are you making the girl uncomfortable? Just look at her. She's, she's even almost crying. Uh, but I, did I call her name? It is not you, my dear. It is not you. Please, oh, I don't want to lose my job. Come I on. Who is talking about you losing your job here? Huh? <laughs> Look, let me tell you something you don't know. You're actually my favorite maid ever. Hey. <laughs> okay? Hmm. So you will never lose your job. No one is sacking you. Now go in and get us something to drink. <laughs> And Sabrina is not going anywhere. Don't mind her. <laughs> Very good girl. <laughs> yes. Frida. Eh? What's going on? Why are you making the girl uncomfortable? Nothing. I'm fine. So just uh, send those things, okay? Pack them and Thanks, my darling. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> um, should I make lunch? I prepared a very nice oha soup. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, you made lunch? Okay, I'm interested. In fact, make some of it. Yeah. I love some of it. That's why it's one. Make it. <laughs> um, I'm also interested, okay? Wow. <laughs> yes. Give me their okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. Frida. Huh? What's going on? Why did you tell her white some of it are like there's a black one? No, Frida, really. What's going on? Eh? Toby, what exactly happened between you and this girl? I know. Like, I really do not... I really do not know what exactly is the problem. Well, I know that there is something really very strange about that alien girl. And I'm very sure about it. Something strange like... Sorry. 
person. This strange like she, she's a witch. <laughs> like <laughs> I'm sorry. I just sorry now. <laughs> Nonsense girl. You did Chris. Let's say I'll go check your head. <laughs> you get malaria. If I say I'll go check your body. <laughs> it's really not funny. I'm like, I drink drink. Did she? Did she fly? <laughs> was actually open so I had to come in. It's okay, it's okay. I actually heard the knock but I was too tired to get up. Do I know you from somewhere? Oh, please forgive me. Victor's school, right? Yes. Please come in, come in. Come in, sit down. Okay, so where is Victor? At least before I take my leave, I have to see him before I go. Oh, hasn't school dismissed by now? Yes, uh, that's why I'm here. We haven't seen Victor for, for some days now. And the exam is about to start on Monday. What do you mean you haven't seen him? Okay, yes. I, tr I traveled to Dubai on Monday, right? Yes. And then, I remember dropping him off at school on that Monday. So... No, uh, since Monday, we haven't seen him. Wait. Just wait a minute. So you mean that Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Victor has not come to school? Victor has not come to school? You've not seen Victor in school since, since Tuesday? Oh. oh. Helen! Helen! Yes, ma'am. Helen. She just says she hasn't seen Victor in school since on Monday. Yeah. I mean, how is that? Oh, um, yes. He came back with courts, um, like life courts, something like that. So, I just left him here so he can heal. Courts all over my son's body? Frida, hold this woman down and call the police for me. Where's my son? She's inside. What? He's not going anywhere. Oh, but why am I? Oh, Jesus Christ, this is temptation. Hello? Yes, 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 yes. Um, uh, please, um, I'm calling from our street. There's a tough situation in our house like now. A very tough one. Please, we do need an officer like now. Please, very urgent. Okay, we are waiting. Please, I beg you, we're waiting. Please, do not take long. Madam, please calm down. Eh? It hasn't gotten to this. You will know. Madam Ellie, hmm? so what happened? Um, I was at the gate when they dropped Victor. So I saw him soaked in blood. I didn't know what to do. I, I, I didn't know anywhere around here. So I used first aid box on him. Ha! That's happened. Lord. But Peter is here. Oh, um, that one. One car dropped him off. He was behaving like an imbecile. Jesus. Maybe they have reason for money which Holy Ghost fire! My ears shall hear no evil, and my eyes shall see no evil. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Stop it. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. I am not a prophet, but I serve the most high God. A thousand shall fall by my side. Stop. Ten thousand by my right hand side. Then none of them shall come near me. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I serve to you, demon. No demon form against me shall prosper. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I set this premises Amen. free. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Stop. You old wish, I cast you, I cast you, demon, in the mighty name of Jesus. Baruch 
That girl will kill Aina and her son. No way, okay? No way. I know who I am and I know the God I serve. Okay. That girl, she's an old witch. Okay. But wait for me. I'm coming, okay? Wait for you. I cannot wait for you. I can't. We wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against powers and prosperities. Okay? Wait for me. I am coming. Wait for you. Just I wait. cannot wait for you. I can't. No, I, ca I cannot. My khakis. My khakis. I need to take them to the hospital. Uh, where's the woman? Oh, she ran away. Oh. Auntie Frida is chasing her. Okay, okay, that's good. Um, um, look after Ben. Please don't let him stand up from here, okay? Victor, stay here, okay? I'm coming. Both of you better shut up. Joy and the school did something to, to, to Victor. So, um, um, Helen said she caught him with a knife. So, we invited the police. It's not the Helen that caught me. What? Uh, excuse me, people. <sighs> Please. Uh, who is the uh, the culprit? Who are we here to arrest? Um, officer, she was here, but she disappeared. Yes. She disappeared. Yes. I, don't, I don't understand. Uh, uh, if she disappeared, why did you have to call the police? No, uh, now advise me, what do we do? Disappear to go and, and arrest her wherever? By the way, who is Freda that called me? Um, officer, it's me. I'm Freda. Um, what actually happened was we wanted to arrest somebody, but some things came up and then we want to change the plan to arrest somebody else. Well, this is obviously uh, a false alarm and you need to come with me to the station to write some statements. Officer, uh, officer, please, why don't you listen to her? It, are you sure you're in your right senses to advise me? No, officer, 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 look, we have a situation here. My, my, my house help, my house help is a witch. Is that a witch doctor, not the police? Police job has nothing to do with Spirit, okay? By the way, what happened to the young man? This is an evidence of, of, of how my house help my treats my son anytime I'm not around. Just look at him. <laughs> Helen, I command you. Come back here in Jesus' name. Come back here in Jesus' name. Come back here. I command you to come back and hell it. You witch! Come back God power conquers all. Um, you think so? Officer, she's powerless to arrest her. Um, madam, you're under arrest.
Excuse me, madam. You're under arrest. You're under arrest. Sometimes women create their own problems by allowing jealousy and insecurity control them. Rose. Rose. Rose was a very good girl. A wonderful cook. My son Victor loved her so much. And she was very hardworking. But I never stopped thinking that that she will soon start having an affair with my husband. And for that reason, I sent her back in. You never know what you have until you lose it. And when you lose it... Mm, I hear you. Then you let me help you. Come with your shoe. And if you drink a so now, five, you will drink. You have to be fast or your mom is waiting for us downstairs. Where's your bag? Your mom is waiting for us and she's outside. Mm -hmm. ah, ah. Victor, don't tell me you are done eating. I am. Please don't tell my mom. <laughs> That's on one condition. That you eat a little more and I'll go inside the kitchen and get your takeaway back. Deal. In everything you do, do it right, do it right. Cause no one steady wins the race. Don't give oh. up, do it right. Good, good morning, ma. Good morning, ma. Good morning, good morning. darling. Where was he? Um, I checked his room earlier on and he wasn't there. Uh, yes, ma. He brought his tray to the kitchen while I was packing his name, take it away. He did what? He, he, he did ah! what? Come here. Come here. Come. Yeah. <laughs> Haven't I warned you to never allow my son engage in any chores in this house? Huh? Look, are you the maid or my son is? You're the maid, right? I'm sorry, ma. Sorry, ma. Victor, get into the car. Shh, get into the car. Look, this is not over. When I get back, I will deal with you. Open the gate for me. Yes, ma. Stupid girl. <laughs> Fine. Yeah. Oh, no. My dear husband is not at home. <laughs> you know him now. Yeah, but he called and said he's coming back today. Mm. No. I went for school runs. Where else? 
Victor's school now. <laughs> uh, so when are we planning to make the trip? Okay. Mom, please explain this to me. Victor, are you okay? Can't you see I'm on the phone? Get out. Um, <laughs> don't mind Victor and his usual disturbances. Okay, oh, look, babe, eh, just uh, pick a date and let me know, okay? All right, darling. Okay, yeah, take care, bye. <laughs> Victor, Victor. Mom, don't worry. Aunt Rose is helping me already. What did you say? Aunt Rose is helping me already. So, so you cannot wait for me, Victor? But you snubbed me. <laughs> I snubbed you? Victor, go upstairs. What's wrong? I said go upstairs now. Run here! <laughs> Madam, know it all. Who asked you to help him? No, I, I, I don't know. Shut up your mouth! I said who asked you to help him? Oh, you, busy. Uh, uh, mm, mm, mm. you thought I was busy, right? When it comes to my son, you don't take decisions. I do it myself. Yes, Did you hear me? Eh? Just, 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 come on, get out of here! Victor! Rose, your food was really delicious. Thank you, yeah, sir. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> um... Rose is, is really trying. You have improved so much. <laughs> I'm teaching you and you're learning. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> right from day one, Rose's culinary skills have been top notch. Sir, Madame is teaching you. He's teaching me. Okay. <laughs> yeah, she knows. Thank you. So you can go. Thank you. Th thank you, Ma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Vincent. Yes. Look, I'm getting fed up with this your job. You're, you're barely around. And this is not right. I thought we talked about this already. You knew the condition of this contract before asking me to accept it. And I actually accepted it because you advised me to. Don't worry. It will be over in the next 90 days, okay? Na three months? Yes. Three it's months. Three months? <laughs> okay. Come on. You know we need the money to pay me for this. We've not finished paying for this house and the investment we talked about too. So come on, relax, okay? Don't need to be. Come on, don't give me that book. Hmm? It's okay. I understand. It's just that Victor wants a little sister or brother. I know. And I don't mind too. But you won't allow me in because you want me fully around. 
Yes, I won't give you around. Oga Victor, are you still awake? No, 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 no. It's past your bedtime. You need to sleep. Fine. Good. So pray for us. Okay. Okay. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the, Son, and and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Thank you, God, for today, for my parents, friends, families. Thank you for our tears. As we sleep, protect and guide us to your Son, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Better not play game again. Night. Huh? Better close your eyes and sleep because I'm watching you. In everything you do, do it right, do it right. Cause no one's there, oh, the yeah, well, uh, I don't like your hair. Eh? Get a new hairdo and maybe get some few things you need as a lady, okay? Yes, sir. So, hey, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Vic, what's the money for? Well, just for how I have to get some new things. Okay. I see you guys are ready. Yeah, let's go. Bye-bye, uh, Victor. Bye-bye, eh? Honey, excuse me, I need to get some. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Where's the money my husband gave you? Don't I pay you salary? Yeah, I do, ma. I do, right? So use the money I pay you to buy whatever it is that he gave you money to do. Ma, I usually send my salary to my younger brother in school. <laughs> I usually send my salary to my younger brother in school. My dear, I have siblings too, and I pay school fees too. Nonsense. Madam, even if you just... Shut up your mouth! It again. I'm sorry, nothing. Okay, so let me drop you at the airport and take Victor to school. <laughs> yes, my driver. Did you just call me your driver? <laughs> I'm sorry. The sky is so much. Anyways, I want to drive. Better, you drive. It's been a while you drove me, though. <laughs> I have to open the gate. In everything you do, do it right, do it right. Cause no one steady wins the race. Don't give up, do it right. Even when it gets tougher, just don't give up. Oh, go, go. Afternoon. 
What's good about the afternoon? Well, sister, everything is good about this afternoon. Look, I just graduated with distinction. Can you beat that? <laughs> you just graduated with distinction. For your information, I graduated as the best student in my own time. Yes. <laughs> so just toss that your best graduating student into your pocket. Sister, you can brag. Uh, I can brag. It's not you that started it. I have to tell you that I also graduated as the best graduating student. Anyway, <laughs> congrats. Thank you, thank you. I'm going out. All right. I'll see you later. Of course, I'll be here. And you take this thing in. Uh. <laughs> What's up, bro? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Watch now. See Dream League. No, you know, ah, uh, what? <laughs> okay. Today, and turn back to tomorrow. All right. <laughs> <laughs> This is wrong. How can somebody working for you be afraid of your presence? Besides, we are friends. She takes care of Victor, cook for you and all. And, 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 and just listen to yourself. Huh? A fresh graduate from a reputable university is friends with a common mate. You're not even ashamed of yourself. Huh? And, and even a stinking one for that matter. What is wrong with you? That we are friends and nothing more. <laughs> you are friends and nothing more. That's how it starts. Yes, that is how it starts. Look, there are obvious things I'm trying to avoid. So please, avoid them for me. Please, I beg you. Okay? Um, by the way, I booked a morning flight for you to Port Harcourt for tomorrow. I will send you the details when I get upstairs. Uh, who is going to Port Harcourt? What for? You are going to Port Harcourt. Yes. In uh, case you've forgotten, your mother still lives there. Uh, she requested that you come visit her. That she's, she hasn't seen you in uh, like a uh, year. No, 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 no. I'm not going. I'm not going. Why? Why? Look at me. I don't have money. How will I go? Have you ever had money? I mean, have you ever made a dime in your life? I might know your bank. Hmm? Anyway, I'll credit your account. And make sure I don't meet you when I wake up. All right? And that's if I don't kill you before morning. <laughs> Just try and kill me. Kill me and see if you will not end up in prison. Stupid <laughs> is really funny so if I allow him he will be frolicking with that good-for-nothing girl huh the next thing I he, he, he will tell me he wants to get married to her they're even playing games together <laughs> okay let me forward the ticket to him he has to go he just has to go Aha, uh -huh. big boy. How are you? Hmm? Hmm? 
So you'll be playing. What are you going to do? With the poop. <laughs> Look, I'll be leaving to see grandma tomorrow morning. To Potakot. Yes, to Potakot. Why? Just arrived. Uh, your mom said I should go and visit grandma. So I'll be going for a month and I promise I'll get you something when coming back, okay? So, do you want to sleep now? Or let me put you to bed. Hope I didn't disturb you. Mm -hmm. Now you are a big boy. Oh no, mom, you messed it up. Young man, you should say thank you first. No, this one she knows that she does it better. Oh, really? This is the hand that just does as she does that. You're even angry. I don't blame you. Rose! Ma? Uh-uh. Victor, you don't even know how to wear sauce. See the way you did it. I'm doing it for you, you won't look at me. You're wearing the sauce like. Hmm. The school bus will come and pick him, so just stay outside and wait for him there. Yes, and make sure the school bus takes him away before you come inside here. This is the height of it. Huh? Even my little boy prefers that thing to me. My husband smiles anytime she's around. My brother Benjamin enjoys her company. <laughs> no, no, no. This girl has come to take over. She wants to take over my family. I mean, she really wants to take over my family. And this is not happening. No, it's not happening. No. It's not happening. Mm -mm. <laughs> this is not happening. Come back here. Go in there, pack your things, and leave my house. Eh? Hey, madam. I don't understand you. What did I do? I said! <laughs> Go in there, pack your things, and leave my house. Oh, please. I beg you in the name of God. Please, this little job is what I use to assist my family. Please, I beg you. I promise. I will change. I will take corrections. Please forgive me. You will take corrections? Yes, ma'am. That corrections you will take will cost me my marriage. And I will never allow it. Okay? I beg you, baby. Go in there, pack your things, and leave my house right now. Or do you want me to go and involve the police? No, ma. Huh? Or yeah, get up. Get up! Ma! Ma, please. Ma! Please, oh. <laughs> These little rats. I know, you're too small. I know, you're too small. <laughs> my salary. Please, I don't even have transport to go home. <laughs> hmm. 
When am I supposed to pay you? Thirty. And what is today's date? Twenty-nine. So how am I owing you? Madam, please. How am I owing you? I don't have any money, please. I'm supposed to pay you on the thirtieth. And today is twenty-ninth. So how am I owing you? Please, ma'am. Shut up! Leave my house. I don't have any transport to go. Please. Leave my house now. I don't have any. Please, ma'am. Madam, please. Oh. Madam, please. I don't have transport. Hey, please. Is this girl oh. Like I'm very thirsty and I need her to get me some water. Rose! 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 Oh. Babe! Ah. Rose is gone. Gone to where? To the market? I like her food so much. You see? Okay, now you see what I'm saying. Huh? What? Everybody thinks she does everything better than I do. Aina. Of course you know Rose cooks way better than you do. I bet you they're mad. Ah. I beg. Oh. Hey. Yes, no. Okay. I have sacked her. Uh -uh. Mm. She no longer works here. You sacked Rose? Yes, I have. So let me see the food you, you eat now. Uh -uh. Aina. But what really happened? Why would you choose to sack her? <laughs> Peep. Peep. And so did they ask person. Do you know that this girl wants to take my husband? How? This girl wants to take over my home. But lie! My husband likes this girl so much. Okay. He, he even gives her money. Even my little brother, uh, 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 Benjamin, enjoys her company. 
they play video games together. Hmm. Do you know the most heartbreaking one? Hey. Victor. Hmm. Even Victor thinks she does everything better than I do. Victor tells me that uh, she does things better than me. Can you beat that? Hmm. I'm going to have to let that girl go. So that tomorrow I will not hear that, that somebody's thing has become another person's own. I can't take that rubbish anymore. She had to go. Oh. Ha, now, wow. On top of my own house, man, my own home. Aina. <laughs> well, I just pray you don't regret your decision mm -hmm. one day. No, I won't. Because that girl was really so fantastic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now that fantastic, she take the whole all of Funa. At least now she's gone. Okay, so how would you now cope with work? And then with Victor? Work? <laughs> I own my own business, but I get my own shop. And it's only, thank God it's only Victor now. I never get another belly. Okay. So I can be able to cope. Oh, well, her life is so easy. Abby? She's your girl, not been of us. Ah, not so now. So whatever you want to do, mm. eh, it's fine by me. No problem. I say, God, let's just forget this issue, Jerry. I think that should be Victor's Kubos. Okay. Excuse me. Boy, look you. You finished all your food in school. You sure? <laughs> big boy. <laughs> Come give Auntie a big hug. Oh. <laughs> How are you? Oh. So how, how was school today? Fine. Hi. You're good? Sorry, sorry. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh. Come and sit with Auntie. Come. Come sit down with me. I've missed you so much. Big boy. Yeah, my boy is very hungry. So let me go in and cook something for him. Very important. And <laughs> You take Victor upstairs and freshen him up while I go to the kitchen and make something for him, all right? <laughs> God. I know. Like, it's just getting so obvious that I'm going to become Victor's nanny in this house very soon. <laughs> it's not a bad idea, my dear I friend. Are you not Victor's auntie again? <laughs> my big boy. I'll cook in the kitchen. <laughs> this is your mommy. Very naughty. Very naughty. Don't worry, let me take you. Let's go. Yay! Okay! Baby! It's nice though. Do you want to get it? Yeah, like Which color? This one is fine, but I think I'm going to this one. Oh. What is it? I don't like onion and there's mm. onion in this noodles. But it's grinded now. I don't like it still. I can feel the taste. Please let my Auntie Rose prepare my noodles. Shut up your mouth. Which Auntie Auntie Rose? If I hear you call that name again in this babe, calm down. Take it easy on this little boy. Victor. Come. You know what? <sighs> I'll make your indomie for you. Huh? <sighs> and I'll make it without onions, just the way you like it. But you do me just one favor, one tiny favor. You go to your room to do your homework, and then when I'm done, I'll bring it to your room. Is that fine? You can give me a five. Big boy. Okay. So you don't want this one? Okay. I'm hungry, so let me just eat it. <laughs> bring the food here. Give me, Ja. Aina.
Oh, mom, I'm late for school. Victor! Mom! What? Mom, I'm late for school. You're late for school? Ah! Then I brought in Helen. A little girl I assumed should be innocent and pure. Don't even tell me I didn't do something right there. Hello. Yes. Good morning. Okay. This is this N Nido Home Services. Okay. Please. I need a house help ASAP. Like right now. Now. Okay. Oh. Y yes. 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 Please. Please hold that one for me. I'm coming for her. Please. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Baby, let's go. God, baby, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. The journey of life is not easy. The going may be good today and turn bad tomorrow. You may be up today. I'm for that tomorrow No one can say What tomorrow will be 